five weeks pregnant symptoms? You've just been initiated to the pregnancy club. Week 5 is a common time for moms to be to find out they're pregnant. If you haven't already confirmed you are pregnant with a urine test, this is the week to do it. Learn about your symptoms and changes during the fifth week of pregnancy. The placenta and the beginnings of the umbilical cord are developing in order to channel essential nutrients and oxygen from your body to the embryo. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. Hit bell icon for more updates. How big is baby at 5 weeks pregnant? At 5 weeks pregnant, baby is the size of an apple seed. Yep, your embryo is now measurable, though at week 5 of pregnancy, it's a wee 0.13 inches from crown to rump and baby's gearing up for much more growth. In fact, in the next week, he or she will almost double in size. You will start to notice subtle changes in your body and you may feel following symptoms in 5th week of your pregnancy. Food Cravings It might be early days, but the food cravings might already be kicking in. Hormones play a part here, so try and relax and go with it as your body gets used to the hormone havoc. That said, indulge your cravings within reason and make sure you're getting healthy substitutes for the foods you can't stand. Tiredness Although still early in the pregnancy, don't be surprised if you are feeling tired already as pregnancy can take its toll in those early days and weeks. Feeling tired and wiped out is common in the first trimester as your body is focused on creating a life support system for your baby and this takes up a huge amount of energy. Build your energy levels up as much as you can by eating regularly and light exercise can help. Morning Sickness You may feel queasy in the morning, or you might even throw up. Nausea can also last all day, too. Morning sickness is a universal pregnancy symptom, and it can make you plain miserable. But there's a good perk of morning sickness, it decreases your miscarriage risk. Low blood pressure. Your blood pressure tends to run lower than normal during pregnancy. This can cause dizziness and even fainting. If you feel dizzy, sit down if you're standing, or pull over if you're driving. Weight gain. At 5 weeks pregnant is around a pound. You will only gain about 5 or 10 pounds in the first trimester, but in the second and third trimesters of pregnancy, that's when you will gain the most weight. The good news is that the tiredness tends to ease off in the second trimester but it'll creep back in again when your bump grows and you get heavier in your third trimester. Cramps. Around 4 or 5 weeks. Cramping could be a sign the embryo has implanted nicely into the lining of your uterus. Or it could be a sign your uterus is expanding and stretching your ligaments. If you're feeling cramping at 5 weeks pregnant that's severe or painful, call your doctor and get checked out to make sure it's not a sign of a problem. Light spotting. It's common to see some spotting at 5 weeks pregnant, but there should be no more than a few drops of blood, not even enough to cover a small panty liner. This is likely just implantation bleeding, but you'll want to mention it to your doctor so that he or she can rule out complications. If you see a lot of blood, if the spotting lasts longer than two days, or you have any concerns, see your doctor right away. Hints for the week. Remember to take your prenatal vitamins every day. Week 5 is when your baby's neural tube, brain and spinal cord, are open but by next week will be closed. Avoid taking any medication unless they are absolutely necessary and your doctor or pharmacist has given you the okay. Some drugs are harmful to embryonic development. Too much caffeine is harmful to a growing baby so it's important to limit your intake to 200 mg a day now that you're pregnant. You might be surprised to learn that caffeine is not just found in coffee, but also in tea, chocolate and energy drinks.